Hi, I'm the PC Expert Amateur, and I just wanted to bring the attention of people who have not become aware yet of the issues with Intel 13th and 14th generation processors. I know a lot of people have already heard from this from Gamers Nexus and other sources, but the fact of the matter is, is that it has been amply demonstrated for many, many months now that the 13th and 14th gen uh Intel processors, especially the i7s and the i9s, are unstable. There's a problem with their microcode, and it requires an update to fix that problem. And initially, Intel did not respond to any allegations or any concrete information about this publicly. They kept it under wraps. They denied responsibility. Uh, this seems to be a, a typical behavior now in the tech uh, industry is, oh, well, it's not our fault. We, it's, it's, it's like they're, they all learned their lessons from Gateway, and they're all trying to sabotage themselves uh, by denying the truth and, and treating their customers right. And it just it's just appalling. appalling. Um, so, you know, if you can get a 7800X3D or some of the other modern uh, AMD uh, ones, I would definitely recommend at this point in time going with those or hold off buying any 13th and 14th gen processors until such time as Intel nails the problem to the wall and puts a stake through its heart because it's not worth your money at all to risk buying a CPU that's going to cause damage to itself, maybe cause damage to the motherboard, who knows, what all is involved in combination, especially with some of the less um, responsible motherboard vendors like Asus and Gigabyte that are, are overvolting. Now, if you already have a 13th and 14th gen, uh, obviously um, you want to be careful to treat it. I wouldn't overclock it. In fact, I would undervolt it. Um, I would be conservative with it. Um, so bring your volts down as much as you can. Well, it's with it still being stable, and if that means that the graphics card picks up more uh, slack for the graphics stuff, that's fine. If the RAM picks up more slack because of, 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 the, of it, that's fine. The point is, is you don't want to have your $400, $500 CPU die because Intel has been hiding this until recently. Um, so if you have any, um, if you have a need of more information. Please check out Gamers Nexus's video and the other videos that have been done about this topic already. I just wanted to make sure that viewers are finding out about this. Thanks for watching and have a great day.